Hi, this is Namrata Rao and you're watching Bollywood Hangama. You've had some amazing films, uh, very tight films as well. Hmm. Uh, but when it comes to movie like Jab Tak Hai Jaan, hmm. like a Yash Chopra film, Shah Rukh Khan, uh, Katrina Kaif, Anushka Sharma, hmm. many feel that it was slightly on the longer side. Yeah, totally. And uh, do you do you accept that criticism that is valid? Yeah, yeah, totally, totally. It was it was quite long, yeah. Right. Okay. And uh, on the on the other spectrum, a movie like Kahani was 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 labeled as it's extremely taut and it's like really fast paced. Mm. Some something that. No one expected Kahani to do so exceptionally well at the box office somewhere. Mm. Did you, did you expect it to do so well? I really liked the film, mm. and uh, I mean, whoever we showed the film had mm. a very good reaction. But of course, I mean, final verdict, so you don't know. But mm. the first time I saw it with the the actual audience in the theaters, I mean, I thought, okay, I think we've made a good film. Right, and um, now when you when you're just editing a, a, a movie, uh, there are lots of factors. Say, for example. Um, if you don't have the raw material in terms of what's being shot, in terms of maybe at times that the lighting is not the way you think that it should be, or maybe anything else. Mm. Uh, shots, so I think they take from a lot of angles. So I, I'm sure that you have not a lot everybody, of not, not all everybody, not all directors, okay. no. Quite a few. I think yeah. most of them they they tend to do it. So how what is what is your reaction when you feel that maybe if this thing is better, hota, to maybe you could have. Yeah, yeah. I, feel feel I feel that in every film, mm. I feel it in all films, mm. but every film has its own politics. Mm. Like, I mean, ultimately it is a director's film and you have to, you know, kind of respect the director's vision. And in some places you're able to push, some places you're not able to push and some places you don't want to push. I mean, whatever it is. Mm. So every film is really a case study in itself. Mm. It's very hard to generalize and say ki aise hi ho sakta hai. Mm. Like, uh, like, uh, Debakar doesn't shoot too much. He's you've very. Done some, you've done a lot of work with, with Debakar as well. Yeah, I've done four films four with him. Love Sex with Kudoka and. Uh, Oye Lucky, 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 I did Shanghai, I did Bumkesh. Bumkesh as well. Yeah. Also worked on his short film. So uh, quite a bit. Uh, Ahilya, you've done for Sujan yeah. Kush, which, yeah. which is really nice. I think all the movies that you mentioned in terms of uh, Beat Love, Sex with Doka, Oye Lucky, and um, Byomkesh, I think some people they felt that maybe it could yeah. have been PCA slightly second half. People, yeah. people had this yeah. opinion. Apart from that, uh, which is the which, which, which is the fourth film? Uh, Shanghai. Shanghai. Shanghai once again, I think extremely well made, and uh, I don't think mm. from what I remember, anyone has had issues with in terms of pacing at all. It was very yeah. very tightly made film. Uh, do you do you enjoy? Uh, he gave you the chance for the first time. Yeah, we lucky. You saw one of your documentaries, I believe. And yeah, that's that's how you yeah. give give the chance. Uh, do, do you owe this to Anil Bakar Banerjee? I mean, of course. Part? I mean, it was really nice of him to take somebody who is who had not edited the film before. Mm -hmm. But I mean, I I'm always grateful for. Uh, for that to him and I really enjoy working with him Bahut maza aata hai. Mm. also he's also from Delhi so we have a common language there too mm. so I, I really enjoy working with him Namta, um, a lot of uh, people would want to join film films um, even the technical aspect not everyone is, is keen mm. on doing uh, like in front of the camera in terms as, an, as an actor or actresses. What is it that you, that you would like to tell aspiring women um, editors who are, who are aspiring to because mostly it is considered like a male domain. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm saying generally because yeah. you're sitting in an editing, editing room all the time, you have men to deal with all the time, yeah. many a times it is odd hours. Uh, what is it that you'd like to uh, share your thoughts or what is it that you'd like to tell people? I mean, I think to break, to be able to break all these things jee, of jee. male domination, ye wo, I mean, you really have to go out there and start working, I think, sure. as women. And uh, whether, I mean, why just editing, mm. even cinematography, sound, direction, everywhere. Mm. Absolutely. And I think most of these things are a reflection of the society we are in. So as things change outside, things mm. also change inside the industry. Right. So I would say that just go for it. I mean, if you feel and Problems are there in every sector. I mean, mm. you know, like is the corporate sector not male dominated? Mm, of course it is. Absolutely. Every every sector, even like government jobs, there are a lot of men. Mm. But you negotiate your way. 
it's just that maybe people feel that film industry is a really you know big dark place and it's not like that it's not like that it's very negotiable of course you'll face problems and uh, you'll face those problems even in a local train so mm. you just have to negotiate i guess